Hey, good morning guys. It's Shwell here doing another video. Uh, it's another event update. I was supposed to post this video uh, over a week ago. Maybe two weeks ago. I had the information. I made the video, thought I uploaded it, and I was going through YouTube just to see if there were any responses to see how much participation for this event and realized that the upload failed. So um, I'm going to redo the video and keep you guys updated. This game is this coming Saturday. September 18th, 2010 at uh, Wayne's World of Paintball in Ocala, Florida. It is being put on by the 6mm Junkies. The name of the operation is Vigilant Sentinel. Uh, it's $25 as usual and it's all day play. Gates open at 7.30 a.m. and the game starts at 10.30 a.m. Now the game can start earlier if you guys get there early and get chronoed and get set up. So the sooner you get there the better. And uh, if you get there early it'll be cooler. Um, now on to the important information for this game. Drug runners are becoming a problem for the U.S. Border agents are being met with, met with almost military force opposition. For this reason, the U.S. military is being brought in as a deterrent to these drug runners. Sounds fun, and Crash and Manhor do a great job of putting props out there to make the game really interesting. Um, the uniform requirements, the U.S. forces will have ACU, Desert, and Tan. Uh, the drug runners will be Woodland, Marpat, Green, and I don't think they would have too much of a problem if you had on civilian type of tire as well. This is a, a scenario based on drug dealers and things of that nature. So, um, you know, use your imagination, come on out, and uh, if you have any questions, please go to their website and ask. I know it's kind of late. It's, today is a Wednesday. It's Wednesday the 15th of September, and the game is the 18th, so... You know, try and get that information. I plan on being at this game, but to be perfectly honest with you, I don't see how I'm going to be able to pull that one because we're down to one vehicle for the next two weeks. And with the new baby and Ocala being over an hour and a half away, that's just not a smart thing for me to do. But I'll try. If I can make it, I will be there, but I can't promise you guys anything. Um, um, so far on their website, there are a couple of people who have already chimed in saying that they will definitely be there. And uh, I find with the 6mm Junkies games, the website never really reflects the amount of participation we're going to get. So come on out. Be prepared to have some fun. It is Wayne's World of Paintball. The FPS requirements are as normal. 400 FPS for AEGs. 450 for support weapons, such as your M249s. And uh, 500 FPS, 550 FPS for bolt action and DMR type uh, sniper weapons. And uh, to be honest with you, I don't think they use the popcorn grenades or things of that nature at Wayne's World anymore. We've been having problems with those here in Central Florida. So uh, with that, come on out, guys. Have a good time. Wayne's World does require biodegradable BBs, and you can get those at the game. Usually SOCOM Arena is there to supply rentals, uh, BBs, and things of that nature. So come on out. Come out. We'll be ready to play. Let's have a good time. I hope you guys are all out there being safe. Let's play some Airsoft. This is the best time of year for Airsoft in the uh, Central Florida area. We got a good four or five months of nice, cool weather that should be kicking in soon. So come on out. Have fun. Be safe. I'll hit you with the two fingers. Peace.